guys, it's Nick Sir. Are you ready? And welcome back to my YouTube channel. So if you guys are new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button below. Turn on the notification by hitting that bell. Give me a thumbs up. And if you guys have anything to say, questions, comments, prayer requests, it don't matter. Please go ahead and leave your comments below and I'll be more than happy to read from it and get back with you as quickly as I can. So are you guys ready for video number 53? All right, so here we go. So today, we're going to be talking about destruction is not an option. So, some people are asking, why am I talking about destruction not an option? Well, before we get to that, let's just join me in prayer. Let's go to our God. In the name of Jesus, Lord, I pray that um, people are going to understand what not to be destructive is all about. And I pray that I, I give them the education so they're going to understand that they cannot be doing destructive things like like disasters or something. So I pray that to be um, to be humble, not to hurt somebody, and not to d destroy stuff. So I, I pray that you um, pr to protect whatever it's going on in this world or something. I love you from the bottom of my heart. In Jesus' name, I pray. Thank you. Amen. Okay. So like I said today, I'll be talking about. Destruction is not an option. Okay. So what is that? What is that? What I'm talking about? Destruct is not an option because th there were like disasters on some places in this world, like hurricanes or coronavirus or um, storms that are very deadly and stuff. And or even like blizzards or something so I, i'm just letting you guys know that like we we have to behave in a, a time in a good manner we have to behave well like we have to be good citizens and stuff not to destroy someone's stuff like destroying someone's car destroying someone's houses and gates and something like that like i know there was like even even someone that 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 destroys people and stuff which is not an option so i just want you guys to know that that there should not be any destruction going on and not to get into fights and stuff so when someone gets to fights then that's not an option unless you um un unless you say something that you have the right to say it and stuff not to be physical about it and not to 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 kill somebody no don't do that okay we're for us we have to come together as one we have to treat people respectfully friendly courtesy um not to say anything negative, not to be racist about it and stuff. It doesn't matter what color it is. It doesn't matter what size it is. It doesn't matter what age it is. It doesn't matter who we are or anybody. So us people, us human beings have to treat other human beings very kindly, very friendly. So that way, okay, we understand this stuff. And I know we're all different and stuff. And in life, we cannot trust everybody. Like, there's some people that don't have a choice. But to do something that's getting worse or something. But you know what? The best solution is God's got your back. God's going to take good care of you. God's going to heal you, protect you from, from, from problems and stuff. So you know what? This is what we have to do. And not to be destructive. Like, you know, we have to build ourselves up. Like, we're buildings. We have to build ourselves up. And not to, and we have to build a bridge. And not to burn the bridge down. So we don't want to do that. And stuff. So we have to, as unity. Unity is we come together as one. We have to treat everybody respectfully courtesy and stuff like that and you know what most of us are christians and we should invite them to come in 
Like, treat them like they're welcome. They are welcome to come in. They are welcome to be heard and stuff. And it doesn't matter what uh, what disability is. I'm just saying, I'm a person with disabilities and there's some people that like me, some people that appreciate me and stuff. Not people that that don't like me and have no trust for me. That's just totally not right. We have to trust each and every one. We have to help each other out. That is what being friendly is all about. That is what being good citizens is all about. So that's what we we got we got to do and stuff. So now if you are a person that's behaving really crazy and not right and stuff, you know what? You're going to get the consequences you're going to get. You're going to you're going to get what you deserve. When you treat people negativity, when you treat people disrespectfully and stuff, then that's what you're going to get. You're going to get a powwow in the back and stuff. You're going to you're going to get bad things happen to you. And you don't want that. So you have to start and we all have to start helping each other out. We all have to start protecting each other as one, as unity. And so, so I'm just letting you guys know, like, I'm a very good friend to you guys. I'm a very good guy. And, you know, I learned my lesson from something that I did, which is totally wrong. But you know what? God said, God, God said, don't do it again. I learned my lesson. And that's what you guys have to start doing. It's like, if you do something wrong, you have to say, I'm sorry. And repent and you have to turn to God and pray for forgiveness because God forgives you and so you, you you cannot do destructive things you cannot hurt someone or destroy stuff the property all, all that you're gonna get in serious trouble and you don't want that so you want to start doing is sit down and think before you do it that's what you have to start doing and stuff so and that's what we all have to start doing so I'm just letting you guys know solutions that will be out there to help you. So you don't you don't want to be around people that are rude to you or disrespectful to you or anything like that. You just want to make sure that we have to be kind to everybody. We have to be polite and very nice and and stuff. And you know what? God's watching you. God's watching all over us. And so we have to be humbled. We have to be patient. We have to be be helping each other out and like uplifting. We have to uplift each other up and stuff. So, all right, I love you guys. God bless you. Just remember, don't do destructive things. And if there's a dis like if there's a disaster that doing destructive things, you gotta pray that this will go away. So that way we don't not worry, we don't have to worry about what's going on with destructive things and stuff like that. So all right, I love you guys. God bless you. Be nice, be kind, be respectful to everyone and peace.